This is Dr. Devur Gita. Hello. And today we're taking a Quilzler look. So, Dr. Gita, we're first going to highlight a uh, degree that you have around the office. It's your MRCP. Uh, can you tell the viewers a bit about what that is and how you got it? So the MRCP is a degree that really means a lot to me. It's a degree that uh, you get at the end of an 18 month training from United Kingdom. It's my mentors in medical school who were really clinically excellent physicians trained in England and had obtained the MRCP degree. And coming from a traditional uh, Indian family, I wasn't really sure at that time if I would be able to actually go out of India to UK for training. Uh, and so I approached my parents and discussed uh, my plans for further training in UK with them and they didn't really have a problem with that and in fact, you know, quickly made arrangements for my further study in UK. The exam itself has a very low pass rate, so passing the exam really fulfilled my early career dreams and also made my parents proud. Uh, when I went to United Kingdom, it further enhanced my clinical reasoning skills, the training over there. I, in addition, I think that's where I actually formed an interest in nephrology. I saw pe you know, patients where, whose kidneys are completely shut off, going on dialysis, but able to recover completely and resume normal lives, while I saw others who needed to be on dialysis and then get a transplant and see the same physician for almost 20 years. And it struck me the trust and confidence that the patients had on their physicians, as well as the long-term relationship that both the patient and the physicians valued. So I was really struck by those, and that's what you know made me choose nephrology. Uh, what advice would you have to give about clinically excellent communication? I think communication and interpersonal skills are definitely the cornerstone or the pillars of patient-physician relationship. Uh, when I see a patient, I don't really ask them, you know, because they know why they are there. They know, okay, I know I have a kidney problem here for evaluation. I really try to find myself more about the patient. I kind of ask them, who they are, what their support system is, what they do for life, what they do for fun. I also try to make it a point that we should be partners in this. Mm. And it's not like one person under control over the other. So in terms of being, you know, making them a partner, I try to provide them as much education as they need about their disease, about the treatment that they receive and all the options. You know, I kind of divide my tasks and things that are important and urgent important but not urgent, urgent and not important, you know, and it's not urgent and not important. So for me, patients, patient care is the one that is always urgent and important. Indeed. The remaining go in the other quadrants, and that's how I try to balance. Dr. Gita, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. That was a closer look. Thank you.